Oh, welcome back. It was a lovely little movie I watched. Where am I going again? Oh yeah, we gotta see about heading up this way. Is there a trap nearby I can uh, shoot? You know the trapper's right here. Seems like I got that gator. Oh, but I was in it. Uh, fuck it. I don't know what's gonna happen when I do this quest. I'm gonna go back around to the trapper. Drop off my gator skiing. Just ripping ass here. Uh, right, left, right, left. Never. Take a look at it. to measure. sell to stores. You want my wares? Right here's the one place to find them. Curtis mean anything to you? It's what the folk out of Lagra took to call in this one gator on the bayou. It's supposed to be the biggest ever seen. folk hunt, but not so many know their way around a needle and thread. It's good business, I'm telling you. Worth it, rest assured. Start using it now, or I can have it sent to the nearest stable. Hmm.
Okay. Good morning. Now. I'm here, let's go ahead and go on that tangent real quick. Why not? Yeah. Howdy. Pardon me. Pardon you indeed. Yeah, excuse me. What the hell? I'm gonna kill like five people right now. My horse won't stop so good. There we go. Shut up, you old bat. Oh my god, really? Are you okay, horse? Ooh, yeah. Yeah, Wait. So. What? You want to come and get off the wagon, please? It's a fucking block, asshole. Excuse me. Hey, friend. Oh, shut up. I can't possibly help you if you don't tell me what you need. <clears throat> Chief, I'm representing the inventor of a humane execution machine, an electric chair. And he, uh, wants to demonstrate his invention here. Ah, I'm familiar with the man and his work. Tell you what, I'll give you a permit, but it's going to cost you $100 in fees. Uh, sure. There you go. Okay. Well, the price is fair. Here you go. And here, sir, is your permit. A pen in unusual formalities, of course, such as uh, finding a suitable candidate for humane dispatchment. I'll tell that to the professor. Good luck. Damn way. Come on, girl. You ought to take care of that boy. You ought to shut your goddamn mouth. Tell me what the fuck to do with my horse in my life. Look at that. Fucking turn on die. That's what we're gonna do from now on. Is he drinking that moonshine? That motherfucker drinking that moonshine. Ah, uh, hello, friend. Hello, Professor. Professor. Andrew Bell the Third. That's it. So, the chief says you can test out your machine, oh. pending the usual formalities. And what are they? Uh, finding a suitable uh, subject. Ah, funny you should mention. This fella here, he seems sturdy enough, and he's guilty as sin. Wilson J. McDaniels, wanted for murder, bigamy, and immoral animal husbandry. What's that? The mind shudders. He's an animal fucker. 
Here, find him for me and help me put him out of his misery. God damn it. Capture McDaniels alive. Where was he at? Why, this is all coming together wonderfully. The final piece Where the of the fuck puzzle. Is this guy at? The grizzly's border? Where is that at? So he's there, okay. Ah, geez, so I'm gonna head up this way. I'm gonna hit, let's go hit Black Bell first. Yeehaw. And other such things. All right. Out of heart. Doctor, you gotta. All right, friend. All right, you gotta be okay. You're gonna help me. Um, um, please. Uh, can I please just kill him? Do something. And you know what? I'm just. What's that? Ah. What the fuck? God damn it! There we go. Alright. There. We had a gold pocket watch. Okay, my girl. Oh, I don't keep getting dis dishonor for Like, yeah, hey, yeah but the whole point is we're a bad guy, right? I'm living the bad guy life. Ooh. Oh, it's a three star. Excuse me. Is that the last one I fucking mangled right there? That's a good white tail buck. Alright, we're gonna end this one a little quicker here. What do we. Oh, shoot. God damn it. 
Oh, he's not worth it now. Alligator snapping turtle, though. He's good. Where's his head at? Over here, right? Yeah. in the whole damn thing. Now, there was a white tail butt. He was over here, he just like walked right up. And he was like, he had a good skin on. One of the trail still. Is that his trail right there? This is a bounty hunter? Dang, this shit ain't for me. Me, friend. Come on, girl. What you got? Oh, okay, so that is the bar map. Yeah. Turtle shell on your back. You there? Oh, hello. You a bounty hunter? Well, not right now, I ain't. You Black Bell? I'd like to talk to you about your Wild West days. I don't care much for reminiscing. You got any friends as bounty hunters? None that spring to mind. Well, then you done led them boys here, and you none the wiser. Ah, those bounty hunters. Knew my luck had run out sooner or sooner. Well, get inside. I'll tell them you're gone. Oh, no, no. I ain't hiding from them scalp hunters. I ain't running from them neither. And fighting? Yeah, if it's just me against them, that'd be a waste of time and nitroglycerin. Well, let me know what I can do. You want that Wild West story, don't you? Yes, I do. All right. Get up here quick. Now, when I give you the word, hit that. 
whole place is wired. Black Bell, I got a contract here for your life or your liberty. My horse dies, I'm killing The sooner you. it be liberty. That's mighty reasonable, mister. Come here, let me take a look at it. Goddamn scalp hunters off your back. Uh, for now. For now. So, you gonna tell me about your Wild West days? Running with Jim Boy Calloway? Little Boy Calloway? <laughs> the only running he did was away from a fight. And that's about the end of it. Well, the man's apparently a famous gunslinger. Yeah, so they say. But, uh, don't get what's famous confused with what's true. The ones of us that lived that life, we was too busy being scared for our scalp to talk to no newspaper writers or dime novel men. Well, what were they like then? Those days they all talk about. <sighs> Same as now, I guess. Only longer ago. <laughs> all right. I'm gonna need your picture, too, if it ain't a trouble. No, sir, no trouble at all. Can't be worse than those awful drawings on the wanted posters. <laughs> Hell, great. Look, well, you stand over there and uh, let me get this thing ready. Uh, ready? How do you want me? Like this? Okay, I got it. And I guess I'll be on my way. Here. <laughs> Well, thank you, Mrs. Bell. You gonna be all right? Oh, been running for 20 years. Suppose I'll be running till I drop. Just the way it is. Yep. Wonder what kind of loot she's got. Good luck. <laughs> and she's gone. Look at these guys we can loot. I'm not 
Huh? Really, honey, they're fine. Yeah, well, I ain't pee if she's got a poop. Yeah, well, put him in a diaper. No. I was gonna let out later when they needed to. Alright. Alright, there's a lot of dead bodies here. Like a lot. A lot of little pocket watches too. Bounty hunter. The funny thing was I did have find one bounty hunter out here. Now where did the heck go? Does it show my hat somewhere? Oh, there's my hat. Look at that. There we go. Did I ever hit this one? Or this one? I don't know. Can we just uh, shut them all up? Oh, wait. Is that... Ooh. Cigarette card. What you got in here? Oh, ground coffee. Why would you why would you leave ground coffee in here, Black Bell? Can I sleep in this bed? Nope, but I can search the drawer. Alright. Oh, I'm trying to the chest. She left a chest here. What's in the chest? There might be something good in here. Black Bell. What's next on our agenda here? Oh yes, the bounty. But if I take the bounty in? Taking the sandy, you know what? Let's just because then I have to ride back, then ride across. And no, let's just let's just go right to. Oh wait, no, I can hit him. Go back. Go to camp. Yeah, that's how you do it. Hit him, go back to camp. You got 
got some Look trouble. <laughs> Slow it there. This is a robbery. You twitch on that. I warned you, little captain. I did warn him, didn't I? Oh shit, if I got. Oh fuck. Because uh... you know, if I take that bounty in. You're just giving it to me. You're my snapping turtle. Uh, I'm on my good snapping turtle, I'm gonna lose it. Alright, so. Alright, forget the bounty for right now, because I got the snapping turtle I gotta keep. Unless there's a trapper. Fuck it, we're just going to story mission. Uh, I can't be hunting. It's too fun to ah, good lord. Thought just like, um, sometimes the traveling, right, traveling can be a bit of a pain in the ass. Yep. Oh, I'm gonna run before this guy sees anything. Oh, God damn it! Hey, stop there a minute, will you? Was this your doing? Hey, you don't think I did this? Guess I have no choice God. but to report. This. Damn it! All right. See, now I gotta kill another dude. Not the varmint rifle. Right. Okay. Yeah. It's a pretty fun game. I mean, you don't get like super punished for being really bad, which I like to be doing. So, all in all, I think it's pretty nice. Yeah, he's dead. Run off. Facebook! What's going on? What? Oh, we're really lost to this. Get out of here. Get out of here. Oh, you know, I just told you to get out of here. You listen.
Oh, that fox is three stars, but I want to get a fox bell. Got him. Easy now. Did you say a three star? Yes, he did. All right. Got me a nice, perfect fox pelt. And he yanked him right off that carcass. Keeping that tail, right? Yeah. Yeah. Perfect fox pelt. I'm going to shove him underneath our snapping turtle here. Snapping turret means some bitches. Oh hey, let me go yeah. pay my debts real quick and then kill everybody at the station. Literally everybody at the station. Now why would you leave the house looking like that? I'll be tending to you shortly. Every penny. There, I no longer have a bounty Lemoyne. There. Get nice that partner. one little bounty hunter off my ass hey. for fifteen dollars. So fifteen dollars is like, oh, it's a bounty. The bounty hunter. Jackass. Oh wait, is this a little uh podunk town? Uh, Emerald Ranch. Look at that one right by it. Didn't realize. All right, well, I don't care about that. We're on straight on to our destination. Oh, good. Thought for a minute I was gonna like fall off my horse again and break his fucking legs like he usually does. Tough guy. Hey, be ready. Shut up. We Do only got one shot at this. Be smart. Quicker. And give them what they want. And before you leave, hand over your money too. Okay, <laughs> it's yours. Faster. <laughs> no, no, no. I'm sealed now. Two properties. Back to back. Oh, help me. Help oh. me. Please. What do you got? No legs, sir? Don't that suck. You try to be nice. Try to be nice and help. Try. And y'all just didn't give me the opportunity to be nice. Now here you're all dead. All y'all. Bit hungry, what do we got to eat here? Some bread. Celery. Ain't 
Nothing to worry about. What the Wait! Hell? This is a misunderstanding! Why'd you do it? Hey, it's not what it looks like. Nothing much. Nothing, as far as I can tell. I wouldn't even worry about it. Just calm down. Should have robbed him. But that was nice. Yeah, yeah. Bunch of assholes. Let's see, do I have anything else I need? Yeah, I'm gonna keep eating this candy. Go! Oh, oh, wrong button, there we go. No, I don't want the assorted biscuits. Did I run out of candies? Chocolate bar. My horse needs some food though. Here, we're gonna give him some beets. You like beets there, bud? Girl? You're a brave girl. Yeah, she's a brave girl, all right. Holy shit. There we go. Alright, we're nice and uh pull up. Check the uh, pathway I'm taking here. Oh no, I'm on the right path. Oh uh, yeah, the oil fields where I got nearly f where I died like fucking four times trying to steal a cart. And then one of the times the horses got scared out of the place. Oh, I didn't need it. Oh girl, you're getting dirty, aren't there you? There we go. Oh, you are getting dirty. I didn't even realize. I'm so sorry. I'm gonna brush you up here. I'm so sorry. Look how dirty you are. Let's Thank get you looking good. There we go. There we go. So sorry. You're okay, girl. Yeah, that's right. She's my good girl. Yeah. Yeah. Here, have, have some to eat. Eat this. Eat a little bit more. You, you need it. Good huh. girl. Alright, let's go. Okay, girl. Yeah. Apparently, horses don't ever need sleep. You just need to brush them, pat them, and feed them. And it was good 24-7. I tell thee, and I tell thee now, eternity waits for us all. Like which eternity? Help a blind man. A dollar for your future. Dollar sure. for your fate. There you go. Mm. Your whole life has been one of regret, but it can end better than it began. Okay. I ain't too sure what to make of that. I'm sure you've got better things to do than follow a lame blind man around. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's, it's starting to deteriorate. This thing fully deteriorated. Um, um. Cooking up some meat so it don't go bad. Cooking up one more so it don't go bad. Okay, was this the squirrel I, I caught? I forget. Alright, that's enough of that. Down wagon. Yeah. Anything in? 
problem. That's good. All right. We are on our way. Like your outside little Avenger? Ooh, it was cold out. You liked that, didn't you? Yeah, you did. And we're back. Excuse me. Came. Of course I came. Said I would. There's a foreman. His name is Danbury. There's the files in the office above the refinery room. There. You see that light up there? I see it. If the files are as incriminating as we believe, Mr. Cornwall's men will destroy them if they know you're coming. There's only one of me, son. I don't intend for them to know I'm coming. What will the files say? There'll be a report from Leyland Oil Development Company. And you got the money? Yes. Any ideas how I... Sneak into this place? You could crawl under the fence, or hide in a wagon. They keep rolling in. I'll go take a look. If there's a problem, call for me. I thought the whole point was that this had nothing to do with you. Ideally. Ideally. If you are quick, you could climb into the back of that wagon. train to San Denis. Okay. Better get a move on then. Start loading up. 
tree was bad. So I can like sneak in right here and it's like a catwalk over or something. Must be Danbury. What? Will you be quiet? Need a file by the Leland Oil Development Company. One about the oil near Wapiti. I... Ooh, fucking hard kick. Danbury. Think, man. Mind is a terrible thing to lose. Especially over such a nice floor as this. It's here! It's here! You've done good, Danbury. Real good. They'll give you a promotion for this. Send me back to get you. Hey, 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 hold it right there. Weapons on the ground and hands in the air. Easy now, fellas. Now, we won't tell you again. Bitch! 
bow and sling with your arrows. That's fucking racist. They know how to use guns. Happy to watch some of that oil burn. So you met Mr. Danbury? Yes, don't worry, he was very obliging. I thought you wasn't getting involved. Thought you were gonna enter and leave silently. Thank you. You saved my life. Thank you. I hope. Well, I don't know what I hope. But who knows? Maybe these will be of some use. Here's your money. Thank you. Total tape. Gang share your shit. Nice. Alrighty now. Let's go out to this guy, yeah? Because I'm gonna be heading yeah. back that way anyway. I could see some guy get fucking electrocuted. How fucking cool is that? Whoa! Skin. Cut near the back. And just fucking rip from under him. Just comes right off. And the antlers just disappear. Well, this is good. I have other skin on me already? I can't believe this. What the hell is pulsing right next to me here? I don't want to see the pulsing. The CC thing was pulsing. Yeah. Ooh, is that a bandit camp? Buffalo! Bison! Oh, this is a good one. Ah! 
Ah, I guess I need a good rifle. Uh, There they are, the whole party. That's the one I want. Right there. Got him. Yep. Yes. Better be a good bison right here. Hey, Got him right in the eye. Oh, come on, good pelt. Okay. Yes. The pelt is good. Yeah, I rifled him. We're good. Alright. Let's go on there, Kyle. Let's go, girl. Is there a trapper nearby? What is Oh shit. Oh fuck. That skirt will play it by ear. Maybe I can steal a horse and uh, carry that one guy back on that horse. While mine falls behind with the uh, yep. pelt. Yeah. We're about to find out. Jesus, they got this dude fucking Easy, set up. Look at this shit. Ooh. Bit cool here. What's going on? Either way, I just have to take that one guy in. Oh, that sucks, Kyle. Oh yeah, work or something? Stealthily, and I'm ultimately gonna fail, but hey, it's worth a shot, right? Oh, what is he looking at my direction for? God damn it. Run, boy. 
I'm gonna rope you. I'm gonna rope you. Treat for you. Goddamn government cat. This is uh, very kind of you. You're okay. coming with me. Up you get. Take me to damn cork then. Alright, we're gonna go back up. Fancy on additional horse. This ain't America. We ain't free no more. Sounds like right, sour so he grapes. Was right up here. You know, you ain't going here. to court. You ain't going to jail either. I'm taking you to a professor I know. What in hell are you talking about? You're a lucky man, mister. You get to be part of a great experiment. Shut up! Huh? You ain't gonna die needlessly is what I mean. Nope. Your death's gonna be in, uh... Important step in the advancement of human knowledge. What the hell are you saying, mister? This professor, Andrew Bell III, I believe he said. Ah. He's a little odd, maybe harebrained, but I got no reason to doubt the quality of his work. Now then. What's this damn professor got to do with anything? Well, he my wants to try this pelts. new electricity chair. Where's my drop pelts? I know I dropped it. It dropped right around here. Air on to kill you. Humane. No. Yeah. Oh, he's gonna strap you into this contraption and run a large electric current through your system. Got something to do with moonshine. Don't quite know what. <laughs> I guess that's why Where's he's a health? professor and I'm the bounty catcher. <laughs> well, as I said, I can pass on his assurances that this is oh, the most fuck? humane way to go. It would be just like, well, like switching off a light. Most humane way. <laughs> they wouldn't let you do this to me. They wouldn't. Oh, oh they would. Oh, wait, does it send me to the trap right there? I think I have to write about that. All right, whatever. In animal husbandry, am I right? Well. You ever seen lightning okay, strike back. livestock, Mr. McDaniels? I ain't ever seen the actual impact, but I came across the pasture sometime after. The storm had just cleared, and there was smoke in the air, smell of burning hair. You know, there must have been a dozen head of cattle lying there, piled up, mangled. Oh, this guy's going to fucking cry. Their backs, legs, and He's going to fry. It's like they was burned. Half like the skin was ripped off. No! Eyes bleeding. Some of them popped out. No! How many shortcuts I can take? Not really. This is pretty much the best path. If I hadn't seen the storm, well, I would have thought some devil caused that mischief. But, no, sir. It was lightning. The electricity does something, all right. I seen trees explode in front of me. I seen desert sand baked into glass. That's what I seen lightning do. But hey, scaring the absolute shit. This dude. electricity professor's got a plan for you. Ah, oh, that must be of an entirely different kind. <laughs> oh, little bitch. Oh. Hell, that nice little. Every time I get something on a horseback, I want to go hunting. Every time. There's a person, then a mess gordon, or a bounty like this dude right here. Every time. Every time. I do like my gold pistols, though. Or my, uh. Wow, my gold revolvers. Beautiful little things. Fast travel. I mean, 
I know they're supposed to be part of the story here. Gonna be an ambush right about here. Oh shit! Ah, push button's not looking at the screen. It's a good thing my horse isn't around right now. I was expecting a little further out, but eh, we made it. We're good. Time to drink my woes away. Uh, just three or four. A little bit of gin. There we go. Hey! <laughs> what? Look at that weapon now. I didn't do that. I, I meant to put my weapons away. There we go. I was meant to say hi to people. Hey, partner! Man, this horse is dirty. Y'all don't take care of your horses back there? Can I punch him in the head a couple more? Ah, uh, we're about to shock the fuck out of him anyway. I guess what the moonshine has to do like some sort of battery or something. Ha, bring him over here. Now where's my money? Um, money? Yeah, for all the running around I've been doing. Oh, well, once they buy my humane electric ending facilitator, there will be money enough for you, sir. Well, let's hope. All right, let's get our, our um. Our poor unfortunate, ready for the demonstration. Oh, do come and watch. It'll be amazing. Come along. All right. I have parcels at the post office? What? Uh. Yeah. Uh, come on, temporary horse. Let's go. Come on, Tim Force. Alright. Oh, I forgot to take one red marker off. So I have mail. Okay. Where's Professor at? 
Where the fuck's Professor at? And my horse is all the way back there. What the hell? Alrighty. Well, let's see here. Let's go hit Charles real quick. Hey, Mr. Oh, howdy. Oh, this horse don't know nothing yet. Buenos dias. It's like trying to drag a I don't know. He just doesn't Bandia. respond. What did I do? Shut up, it's a new horse. Alright, so what's this art gallery about here? Where the fuck is it? Do I have to go upstairs? Oh, this is fancy. Oh, fancy. Enjoy the show, if that's possible. It's a free show, so don't come I just don't like how much time you're spending with the man is all. Just wait Ooh, until you see his work. It's very Three fucking cigars. Well, Hell I'm not so yeah. very sure how I feel about progression. Paintings or otherwise. Oh yeah. Three Come cigars. On. You won't have seen the like of it Hell before. Yeah. I prompt. Is there anything else for the taking? There's some cigarettes right there, it looks like. Hold, hold on. Let me compose myself. Alright, so let me go find this fucking whack job painter. Wherever he may be hiding. There's plenty of people here. Far too modern for my There he is. Mr. Oh, look at all them titties. Look at these idiots. Uh, it's making me blush. Excuse me, Mr. Chatonet. Couldn't you have painted some drawers on her? Madame, I paint her in her natural state, as she was and will be in paradise. There's nothing natural about that. Clothes are civilization, repression, death. To be naked is to be free, innocent, alive. Like Buddha said, you know. We are all just here to fuck. <gasps> well, that explains the decadence of those hot and But it doesn't say hey, that. But you I, got a picture of my wife here. In her delicate. <gasps> Henry, oh. is that your behind? Oh, why would you be showing it to that man? That's my mama. <gasps> as nude as the day she was born. Stop oh, looking at my husband's buttocks. Mm -hmm. Stop looking at my mama. Well, maybe <laughs> she shouldn't expose herself like that. This is disgusting. The nerve on you. That's it. <laughs> oh, come on, Mildred. This is no place for us. Come here. I am a bitch. You're a filthy little man. Oh, oh, come on, horse. We are leaving. Oh, I'm coming after you, Frenchie. Hey. All right. Excuse me, I picked my hat up. Ooh, I'm a looter. Fuck yeah. Excuse me. Oh. One second while I pick up my hat. Please. Oh, that's not my hat. Fucking jump over my goddamn hat. Alright, alright, little uh, Pip Squeak dude. You can, like, wait two seconds. There's a couple of bodies here. They're hoity toy types. They gotta have some money on them, right? What? Alright, this guy's gotta have something on him, right? Come on. Okay. Pocket watch, five bucks. These guys don't have shit on them? Are you kidding me? Oh, are they fucking dressed for the park? If you're gonna try and take, make me take you out of town, we're, I ain't doing that. Yeah, that's kind of messed up, isn't it, Christine? You know, go and get fisticuffs here, get my hat knocked off. I don't even get any money out of it. That's some horse crap right there. The exhibition. What can you say? It was not boring. It was not. I thought I was a father. 
de l'hôpital et du brush washer. Now I'm not sure. We provoke emotions, no? You keep provoking emotions like that. All your yeah. canvases have okay. punch holes through. What are we doing? I told you I was a poor ass. You did. Yeah. And you are. And you showed a bunch of poor ass. Now maybe go be an asshole somewhere else. Somebody needs to trim that one. Ah, here we are. I know a lady over here. She may let me stay for a while. Does she have herpes? Good luck. That picture I gave you, it will be worth something someday. I can feel it. Yeah, I'll be worth the punch in the fucking face, judging right from your now, other art. Like the only thing it'll get me is kicking the ball. Oh. oh, you are funny, you know. I hope to see you again sometime. I am just popping my the fucking angel, head right my now. Let me in, let me in. Oh. Jackass. Alright. Now where is that public execution? I am waiting to see. Hello, sir. Out of the way! Excuse you. Hey, excuse you, woman. Where is that temporary horse at? Alright, where is this? Do we got the, the thing on this execution yet? That fucking professor done took off. I don't see it. Uh, I gotta go get that bounty later. Alright, we'll go to the post office while we're waiting around. Hey, I won't see the execution till the story advances. I don't know. Temporary horse, there we go. I don't know anybody, because I would just fucking run their asses over. Now, I have pelts on my horse. I wonder if I can sell those pelts at the trapper right now. Hello. I saw this hunter bring a bait to sell him cow. He killed a whole... My God, he calls you a man. Oh, what do you have for me? All right, let's have a look. Pleasure doing business with you. Uh, Hello, I'm gonna avoid the fence for right now. Really? Yeah, you best run out of the way. Come on, girl. <laughs> Four guns on me, at least. Better run out of the way. to make my entrance dramatic. And here we go. Jesus. Yeah. Y'all didn't say that. It wasn't a good entrance. Alright, what you got for me, boss? If you would give me a minute, please. Do I have a bounty yeah, anywhere? Start over. Nope. Good. Well, how can I be of service? Invitation. Let's see. Love and making acquaintance, yada yada, meet some people I didn't know how to study work for here. Yeah. Accents and documents, please. Now I've no, spent for a dollar, probably make it. But just not to know that I'm up. Perhaps you're gonna hope for tears for my cold old in. Tells me meeting, yada yada yada. Okay. Thanks, pardon. Hey. Saludos. Now, say it like you mean it, mister. Hello? All right, calm it. I'm only rattling your cage. No more of this tonteria. What chapter am I on? Story. Chapter. Oh, I'm going to save it, so we're going to... All right. No, oh, it's already 11. Wow. Heart is swaying. That's not the right. Where do I find out? I think I'm on chapter 4. Let's see. Where are we at here? Nothing highlighted. And I 
I'm not going to waste any time at the moment. So we're going to head back to camp and see what Sadie wants to do. Probably shoot up a bunch of people again like she did last time. Even though we explicitly told her no. Out of the damn way. Take a pamphlet. How about you shut your mouth and I don't take a pamphlet? Fair. That dude walking on a light pole. Yo. Go over to, can I retrieve my horse right here? I should be able to do that, right? Can anybody show me some kindness? Nobody's gonna show you any kindness. Manage my horses. White lightning. Bam! Got her back. Upgrade her. Oh, I got a new saddle, right? Yeah. Hell yeah. Do these do anything? Like, uh, we're going with our gator saddle. That thing's awesome. Can anybody show me some kindness? There we go. She's all good. There we go, girl. Oh, hey, our pelts. Oh, geez, that's a runaway horse right there. Is there a dude on that horse? Oh, beggars. Ah. Sure. Go get yourself something to eat. Sir, I want you to have this. Thanks, friend. It's Special. nice to give something instead of just begging. Special snake oil? Wow. Be there, girl. I hate asking for money like a goddamn worm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I ain't gonna... What you the hell? You fucking ran right at me. What do you mean, the hell? Giant douchebag? Oh, 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 steer clear. Hey, partner. Howdy. Buddy? Who's this then? Yeah. You gotta be friendly with the Hi locals. there, mister. You may just decide to stop off the trail and rob one of them. Hey, mister. Not him, though. No. No. Get out of my sight. What? All right, simmer down. Hey, hold up a sec. Get somebody else to pull over for you. Devil take you. God damn it. Trying to rob you, dude. Hold Devil still. Take you. Stop! I ain't playing you. God damn it! Oh, buddy, I'm trying. I'm trying to rob you. Oh, it's too late. I tried. Oh. Oh shit. Oh shit. There's like three fucking witnesses here. Oh shit. Okay. Be very careful. Ah, crime reported. Oh, snap. Help! Wait! This is a misunderstanding! It's too late. It's too late. I might as well just keep running. Oh, shit! Oh, shit! The law! The law is on their way! Oh, shit! Alright, we're just gonna... We're just gonna run away from it all, yeah? <laughs> oh, Tom, I gotta scroll down here real quick. What's going on with the other comments? Wait for me in. Now, come on. I was giving to the camp. There's only like two or three pelts. Oh, Jesus. 
Yeah, an hour bounty. Yep. Yep. Murder. I know. <laughs> Fifteen dollars to get away to mur murder. Isn't that something? Who's there? It's Arthur. What do you mean it's Arthur? I mean, did, or, does everyone? Does everybody fucking blind in this camp? Get that horse out of here! Calm down. I have donated like two thousand dollars to this camp. You want to tell me to get the? Oh, you're lucky. I can't pull a gun out right now. Come here, Arthur. Yep. Who the fuck is alerted right now? Out there. Don't forget to go hunting, Mr. Morgan. Ah, yeah. Well. Here are the stews for the camp. Good, good. Meat. Good job, Mr. Morgan. Hi there, Arthur. So who the fuck was alerted running away this way? Oh, something's up with him. Look at him. He's all bugged out. He's got an exclamation point on him. I don't know what's going on, but I'll have to go find out. Alright, come here, asshole. Morgan, you got any hair pomade? Thank you for your help with Miss Jackson. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Don't mention him, Miss Grimshaw. You're a fine man, Mr. Oh, Morgan. that's right, I got his Sometimes compass. At least. Turn around, jackass. Thank you. I think. No reason. <laughs> you got some guts, kid. So, you mentioned you lost your compass. Well, here you go. Ah, that's a beauty. Thank you, Mr. Morgan. Here, take this. I, I know it's not much. Hey, I'll always take some rum. Ooh, rum? Is it a pirate rum again? Ah, damn it, fucker. Better be good rum next time. And that pirate rum is awesome. Hi, Arthur. Oh, might as well eat. Get me some stew. Mm -mm. Just drink it all down. Come on, what are we waiting on? There we go. Get ourselves some coffee too. Yep. Mind, mind, body, and soul right here. What are you looking at, kid? Get lost. It's a nice place you brought us to, my brother. Yes. Lovely, isn't it? Uh, makes me miss freezing to death in the mountains. <laughs> yeah. Little bog over here, yeah. Alright. Good. Alright, Sadie, let's go fucking shoot some dudes up, because that's exactly what you want to do, isn't it? You know what? <laughs> About to go on a journey there with Sadie. I'm gonna need one of these. <laughs> well, let's go. Yeah. Let's do this. How you doing, Mrs. Adler? How are you? Been quite a journey since I, well, since I joined you fellas. Yes. And now you and Dutch have joined high society. Oh, Lord above. Yeah, it seems so. I think my days in polite society are over. Well, I just saw Bill Williamson at a party at the San Denise's mayor's house. <laughs> if he can do it, anyone can. You get any leads? Yeah, I think so. You know so, Arthur Morgan. Come on. We need to talk. Oh, up the... Miss Sadler, will you excuse us? No. When are you gonna let me come robbing with you, Dutch? My lord, a few more like her, we could take over the whole world. Yeah. A few more like her, there wouldn't be much of a world left. <laughs> yes, yeah. perhaps. Now, the trolley bus station. I went down there. I took a look at it. I think we can hit it. <laughs> I ain't never robbed in a city before. Well, you leave the planning to me. You'll ride with me. Always. Is it just you and me? No, we'll need one more, I reckon. Sadie. I say Lenny. Not Micah. Well, that depends if you want a massacre or a payday. 
No, I wish that there was something I could do to make the two of you get along better. Well, that's easy. Make them change. Very <laughs> funny. Uh-oh. What is that? What the? What the hell have they done to me? Holy Look, shit. They're in the tree line. Everybody take cover! Oh, fuck. Oh, Driscoll's. Oh, uh, Lancaster. Here. Jump down, jackass. Fuck. Damn crap. Homo oh, damn Driscoll. Who's happening? Oh, Driscoll, get upstairs. Stay for that. Hold in here. Stay away from the window. Uh, get inside fast. Come on, quick. Don't let anyone back through that door. Hold here. Hold here. At the moment, let's try and keep it there. Jesus, really? <laughs> oh, fuck. Alright. Now I know it's coming. Son of a bitch. That was a... Ah, that's a motherfucker right there. <clears throat> Excuse me. Oof. Alright, let's keep going here. Okay, motherfuckers, let's do this. Do I have my guns? Can I get to my horse? You know, fuck it, it's a dynamite at him, huh? Get no. those doors barricaded quick! Good! Now, everyone, I got this. Get these windows covered quickly. John, you take the windows over there. Charles, you take the side doors there. Arthur, you take the windows in the back. Go! Everyone accounted for. I think. Hey, I said it's everyone accounted for. I don't know. I think. Ow! Damn, Jerry. You should never have taken that O'Driscoll. Huh? Lily didn't go out last time. Oh, you want me to let her out real quick? Yeah, she's walking around. Come on, Lily. Let's go outside. She wants to. Come on. Just don't sit on the table because you can't jump down. Come on, Ryan. Come on. Oh, you too. All right. Hey, let, let the cat out too. Everybody outside. <laughs> you mean you don't want him going outside? He goes outside where he gets a chance. Fucking escape artist. That's Mrs. Sandler. She's still out there. 
Cover me. Okay. That's usually the thing, is that? That's usually how it goes, right? She's so happy to see us. Why didn't you get inside? And miss all this? Come on, Arthur. Now we go back. All right, hold on, I'm looting now. We need you in the house, Mrs. Sandler. Oh, no, thank God. That's <laughs> friendly. Oopsie. Sadie, what are you doing? Karen here. Uh, poor kid. Mr. Swanson, would you take this boy and bury him someplace near, but not too near? Of course. Charles, help me with the body. We need to get this place cleaned up. Mr. Pearson, Miss Grimshaw. Already taking care of it. Come on now, work. Como Driscoll. That man can really hate. Me. So can I, Arthur. So can I. We need to get moving. Away from here. So we should start looking for another camp. You ain't thinking big enough, Arthur. You ain't seeing the vastness of our problems and our opportunities. And the I'm not sure I... One second, I'm gonna get him back in. They've been out long enough to do what they need to do. One second. Hey. Hey, get inside. You're barking out a fence. Nobody on the other side. Come on, Riley. Let's go. <sighs> Riley, come on. I'm going to meet you guys for a second. fucking pound here or something. And we want to take a dog off my hands? I'm joking about that. My wife would kill me. I get you. You will, son. You will. Meet me near the trolley station. We got work. Shall we? Yep. Ugh. Moving all them bodies. Oh man, I all that stuff I could have looted. Aw. I love looting dead bodies. Taking their hats sometimes. Kieran, that poor kid we spared from O'Driscoll's gang up in the mountains is dead. They chopped his head off and tried to kill the lot of us. The whole place gives me the creeps. Now we're moving on, right? Not yet, apparently. 
Another day, huh, Arthur? Uh, okay, so we're not moving on. Okay, so I'm meeting at the trolley station then. Are there any other, uh... Nothing, okay. How's my uh, stuff looking? Dead eyes down a little. Don't want to just take a nap. Where's Sadie? Oh, Arthur, I can't believe those pigs did that to him. Yeah, 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 they did that. He was such a gentle soul. Okay, yeah, yeah, he was, he was a good kid. I'm gonna go he take a nap. my life one time. I'll miss him. Good night. Make the bastards pay, Arthur. Good, good night. If I'm we walking, get the chance. I'm walking away we now. Surely shall. <laughs> Wait, I'm asleep. Rich. Ah, good night. Evening. Yeah, you know what? Let's go evening. Why not? Oh, look at that glorious long beard. Ah. Oh. Shudder with excitement on that beard. Oh, he probably should be dead. Much hair talk. I pumped him all at once. Alright. Probably should restock this thing. Pistol cartridges. Fast travel. Fast travel. Sandy. My snake skin fucking saddle. Let's go, White Lightning. Chapter 5? I have a bounty here. I would say as well, the streets are so quiet, but there are people around, so we're, we're good. It's other horse. He's he's still there. He didn't move at all. Oh, that's sorta of loyal of him. Alright, I'm gonna go hit the post office right next to Dutch. I need to clear that bounty out so I don't get the lawman after me every five fucking seconds. Cause that fifteen dollar bounty will turn to like three hundred real quick. What the hell is going on with you? I don't know what happened back there, but I am running about it right now. Say for a second, like I was so positive commotion over there. My friend, far away, a little wave, you know, they do. How much you can tell my way? Shit! Sorry. This is one for the authorities. All right. Uh, okay, I'm just gonna have to turn myself in. I am so sorry. Where are you at, Lawman? Here. Relax. What's going on? Is there a party I wasn't invited to? Everything's fine. I was just leaving. 
Why don't you leave now before this gets any worse for you? Okay, okay. Keep your hair on. Well, that's been yeah. move along. Move along to where? Yeah. Can we just get out of the area? Get out of the area. Alright, and get your panties out of the twist. Alright, what's the comments here? Oh, okay, so I'm still. Alright, so I'm guessing like new camp is each chapter. Uh, chapter 1, snow camp. 2 is um, that horseshoe area. 3 was what? The, the river area, and this is 4, the house. So I guess I'm getting a new camp in five, right? Aha. Uh -huh. Alright, uh, net, net. five more dollars added on my bounty. Alright, this. God damn it. Oh my God. Uh, I'll pay my bounty. I'll pay my bounty. Don't just. God damn it. I'm not on the Shit. goddamn. I'm not on the run. I'll pay my bounty. No, put put the gun away. Just, just, all right, fine. I, I surrender. I fucking surrender. All right. <laughs> yeah. All right, all right, fine. We'll have a little bit of fun with this, folks. Have a fun. Yeah, oh my god. I told y'all I didn't want to... Uh, just, just, gone. Alright, I'm, I'm, I'm done now. Thank you. Finally. Yes, dead. Yeah, I know. All because I, I was just trying to do my job, go pay my bounty, and Lawman decided to spot me after I passed him. Uh, that's fine. That's just fine. Only $49. Come on, White Hat. There you are. Good girl. How are you doing? Are you, are you doing okay there? Good? We good? Can we get a little bit of food? There you go. I'm going to brush you a little bit. Yep, yep, you're a little dirty. A little dirty from the ride. There we go. Yeah. Yeah, that's my girl. Yep, yep. Alright. Give me Kaya, motherfuckers. Whoa. What the fuck are you on? Come on, out of the way. You're, you're lucky I just got done with all this trouble. Alright, fucking pop you right in the goddamn mouth. All right. All right. Let's try not to run anybody over this time. <laughs> Jump the horse. That'd be even worse. Hey, move it. Why me? Huh? Just stop it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's the exact same thing. Oh my goodness. I like to make a dramatic entrance. I just run everywhere. No, we did it to you shortly. Here, pay the bounty. Ready was it? Ninety fucking dollars. Holy shit! Oh, what? What? Oh no, shit! Thank you for your help. If I just wear that, I got that psycho mask, but if I just wear that, will it scare people? Let's see, what if I just put the psycho mask on? Howdy, sir. You, uh, fixing to raise some hell? Howdy, mister. That mask you got show is shame. I'm just gonna wear the mask. It scares the fuck out of him. That's good. Hey there, partner. Hello there. <laughs> Some guy with the mask going, hey there, partner. Alright, let's go. Alright. 
Oh, did I just take the mask off? No, 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 no. No, no. If I take the mask off, gotta wear the hat. It's like a rule. There we go. All right, we're good. Wait, 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 wait. Lancaster Peter. Pumpy. There we go. There we go. All right, we're good to go. There you are. Come on, keep walking. You're late. Couple of days in this place, you turned into some clock watching city boy. What's the urgency? We need to leave forever. We've been doing well, making money, but for us all to leave together, we need enough for a boat. Now, I found a friendly ship captain. He's willing to take us to Australia or Tahiti. We just need to pay for passage and give him money for land when we get there. No questions asked. We will disappear, be reborn. Well, where the hell is Tahiti? South Pacific. An untouched paradise. Who lives there? Tahitians, I guess. <laughs> we made a bit of money on that riverboat job, but not enough for us to leave and live peacefully. Where's the rest coming from? In there. So we are gonna rob that place. Well, I didn't think we was fixing the plumbing. I don't know if you have noticed, but we are on the clock. I reckon we got a few days before the Pinkerton show, and then well, we're done. Now, we need money. Bronte mm -hmm. said this place has got money. Come on! Ladies and gentlemen, this is a robbery. Behave as I tell you, and none of you will die. Annoy me, and you all will. Now remember, we just want money. Don't make us kill you. This your M. Leave Money. Now. Hand it over. Mr. F. Okay. Get that room back there. Fine, it's yours. I got this one. Fine. That's your choice. Not mine. Kindly open that gate. Give me everything you got. Money lady. I ain't playing here. Now. No, no, je vous en supplie. I said open the gate and let my acquaintance in. Yes. There's of nothing much here. What? There's nothing really here. You're sure? Yes. Then get out here and get ready for company. All of you. Behave. We don't want to hurt any of you. Mr. M, check the safe. Sure. Open it. I don't think they keep much cash in there. Open it! There's almost nothing here. There should be stacks of cash in there. He told us there was. Look again. There's no stacks. A few dollars in coins. That's it. Damn! We got a problem. There's a ton of cops out there. Come on now! We got you surrounded! That Let's greasy son now. of a bitch! He set us up! You think? This seemed like a good time for sarcasm to you, Arthur. What are we gonna do, gentlemen? Something! The trolley. The trolley! Follow me, gentlemen! I've got a horse. Oh, now! Does this trolley go to Tahiti? Come on! Ah! Look out! Right! Coming out of the back! Oh, ah! 
Uh, Dutch your hat! Dutch your hat! So the, the, yeah, I fucking pulled my, my guns out. Second, I need to take something to that. Thank you. All right. Can I loot these bodies real quick, please, Dutch? Oh shit! More again. Yeah. Oh, Dutch.
keep going, kid. You okay back there? Don't worry about me. Just get us out of here. Ooh. Look out! Oh, that's Take it forest. easy! <laughs> God damn it. Uh. I think we're clear. You know what, Dutch? Next time, let's not damn discretion. Seemed like a good lead. I know, but... Well, we made it. Thanks to you. Don't mention it. Yeah, you're a good kid. Well, we each got fifteen dollars. Oh, and a quarter. Don't forget the quarter. Shut up, Arthur. He set us up. He was set up by everybody. Played me like a yokel. Put the law on us. What did we do to him? What did I do to him? I guess he thinks he's the king around here. He don't want the likes of you. So, what are we doing next, Dutch? Kill the king. We just need money. One more decent take and we're gone. The bank is our bet. Jose agrees. Even after that, especially after that. I don't feel so good. Now you just got a bash on the head. Come on. I'm taking you back to camp. Hey, you did real good there, Lenny. Just wish it could have turned out better. Well, I can't win them all. What the fuck am I supposed to do? Did you fucking drop me out in the middle of the goddamn woods? Assholes? Alright, where are we going now? Alright, that's in there. We got anything? I guess I need to head back to camp and they'll probably trigger the next uh, story mission, huh? I mean, that's my, my guess, anyway. It's been a while, girl. It's been a while? What do you mean it's been a while? Yeah. Alright, can I straight shot it back? I can straight shot it back. And then, and then that's just a little bit. Yeah. Yeah. I'm not in the mood for a hunt right now, unfortunately. Oh, I can get that fox though. Damn it. Alrighty. Well, that was. Ooh, you hear that gator? about robbing people right now as much as I want to. Dang. That old Driscoll boy got fucking head caught off. And we got shot up and they're like, hey you know what? Oh shit, we need to not worry about this and move on. And then we just keep getting we just keep getting played by everybody. They we keep thinking they're the fools and we're the fools. Every time kind of crazy and out of hand. And I can see it's just going to keep getting worse and worse, isn't it? There might be some retribution at the end of the game, but when when they, then the, uh, oh jeez, I even forgot his name. What's his name? Got shot in the head? Back in Rhodes? That, that got me, that pissed me off. Straight through. There we go. Oh boy. Yep. Oh boy. No horses in camp, Arthur. Yeah, Arthur. yeah. Shut your mouth. Come up here. I know. I know. I'm coming right up. I'm pissed. Good morning, Arthur. Did I put away one of my guns, really? in the mansion district. I don't like San Denis. It scares me. It's like a city built on... built on I don't know what. Yeah, it's the old man killed himself. Alright, he's shotgun his head right there. 
Hey, can I search this stuff? You got cocaine going here? Yeah. We... Oh. Who's his letter to? Or fro? Molly's poem. What's this? Blank. All right, Dutch. So, Arthur, you get the deciding vote. For what? We take an insult and scurry off like cockroaches? Or deal with business the right way? We don't need to take revenge. We hardly know the guy. This ain't about revenge, Hosea. Angelo Bronte don't mean shit to me. This is about the fact we are planning to rob a bank in his town. A bank that he no doubt protects. A town where his men are gunning for us. Before we do that, we need to put him I out of commission. I disagree. There's always an easier way. There ain't no easier way. Now, I know his type. He is a vindictive little power broker who rules by fear. Now, we pull that stunt in his cesspit of a town. We're doomed. You want to leave this place? Leave this country? We need that money. Just don't feel good, Dutch. This is it. This is the last job that we are ever going to pull. Dutch? Before the year so. is out, we are going to be harvesting mangoes in Tahiti. Oh. Farmers. But we need seed capital, and we need to leave. You know it. I know it. Forgive me if I can't think too much about the mango harvest. This I'm... is it. Trust me. Arthur. If it's business, well, business is business. Angelo Bronte stands between us and our future. You'll damn us all. Yeah, probably. Arthur, come on. <laughs> That's all that's been said. I am. It ain't getting any better. I've heard that before, and usually I've been right. Uh, if you say so. Quit doubting, Arthur. It does no favors. Come on. We need to go see a man about a boat. First a come, boat? We're headed to a settlement called Le Grand. I met a boatman there called Thomas who knows these waters like the back of his hand. Why do we need a boat? So we can attack Bronte's mansion from the swamp. Catch him off guard. He knows we survived the trolley station, so he'll be expecting some kind of reprisal. All right. Okay, makes sense. See, Jeez. I do still possess some capacity for rational thought, Arthur. All right, you jackass. We're all gonna die, man, aren't we? That's just it. We're all okay, gonna die. Follow me. Thank you. Cinematic mode. What? For taking my side back there. It ain't about sides. Feels like Jose has lost his spine. But this move on Bronte. Is it for the bank job or revenge for what happened at the trolley station? Both. Neither. What does it matter? We need to hit that bank. And Bronte has the police and just about everything else in San Denis in his back pocket. He also set us up. And lest we forget, took young Jack. I understand. We just got a lot of pots on the boil, given all the folks who's out gunning for us. You all seem to have forgotten how money is made and what it takes to support job? 20 people. Let alone what it takes to give 20 people a new life overseas. With all due respect, Dutch, is this Tahiti plan really going to work out? You tell me, Arthur. Is it? Have some goddamn... Faith. I am bending over backwards to make a future for us. I know, but but call that bait there, but, buddy. When did you become so small-minded? If you'd rather we break up the family, go our separate ways, just tell me. Of course not. This isn't a prison camp. I am not forcing anybody to stay. 
I know. Steal a white right. alien. Just feels like we're on borrowed time again. I mean, the old Driscoll's found us. Yeah. We need to move. And soon. Haven't I made that clear? I feel like I'm going in circles with all of you. Micah is well, the only one I've left been with here any before, loyalty. And, uh, anyway, I wasn't too kind last are. time. Let me do the talking. Do I, am I put, did I put my mask on? Cause I, I feel like I should put my mask on. Thomas, it is good to see you, my friend. Hello, Mr. Dutch. Thomas, have you met Arthur? Arthur, Thomas is quite the boatman. He's gonna help us get close to our prey. Quite the boatman. The other night got we quite had the one eye man too. Adventure fishing for catfish. Now, my friend, can I call in that favor? What do you need? You know Angelo Bronte. Well, exactly. We need to make a social call. We were hoping you could row us in quietly one evening around the back of his house. Well, if anyone can, I can. We'll pay you for your trouble. If you're bringing him trouble, it won't be no trouble for me. Good. My business partner, Jules, he's out on the skiff. I need to check with him. Plus, I need to check the traps. Would you come with me? Of course. Arthur? Why not? Shouldn't take too long if we can find it. Be live. Mind you, there's a lot of gators. Uncommon number. Big ones. Great. Come now, Arthur. It'll take more than a prehistoric reptile to scare you, Shirley. I just want to see you meet your match when it comes to a, an aging predator with a big mouth, Dutch. <laughs> Arthur here is something of a comedian, Thomas. More of a jester than a gunslinger. Well, if you say so, Mr. Dutch. This way. Come on, this way. Follow me here. And stay on the high ground. Uh, high, Call this ground. There are two dead bodies like out there. Me. Down here, we can't be too picky there, Mr. Arthur. Got a couple of crayfish traps up ahead. Couple of dead bodies right beyond too. Mr. Dutch, you keep a lookout for company. Mr. Arthur, check the traps with me. This one's empty. Alright. I got a few more set over this way. Come on. I don't want to know what just touched my leg. Mr. Dutch, you show you the right fellas to be going after Angelo Brunton? Oh, he's much more the kind of reptile I can handle. I'm about to fight a gator, aren't I? Stay close. Make sure you follow my line. Oh, I fully intend to, Thomas. You too, Mr. Arthur. I'm gonna be fighting the gator. You can see why even in swamp waiting hasn't caught on as a pastime, can't you? I love it out here. Peaceful. Nobody bothering you now. Except for the night folk sometimes. The night folk? Yep, some strange people around these parts. Wilder than the animals they are. Well, this just gets better and better. Like I said, we need to be lively here. Oh, jeez. Up to my nipples. It's not a term I like to use uh, lightly either. Whoa. Stop where you are. That's a gator. Just stay as still as you can. Alright, let's keep moving. I got another trap by that small island up here. I don't know what's taking Jules so long with that boat. 
I think we are all equally keen to find him. I heard that. No, oh shit. I'm about to be attacked by a gator. I'm about to be attacked by a gator. I fucking feel it. The hand it was off. This trap is stuck in the mud. It happens. And this is where I get fucking attacked. By a gator. Ooh. Guess something didn't want to be caught. My God. So it's true. What is? There's been talk of a big old bull, but people talk a lot of nonsense. I guess this was... No, but only some huge could do this. Oh, fantastic. Let's hope it bites you first, Dutch. Should we just keep moving? I don't really want to hang around here much longer. I... I suppose this can wait. Let's go. Hold up. A lot of gators, huh? Mean all some bitches. Oh. My God, there's no shortage of them. Good eating. Us or them? Exactly. Come on. Ah, <laughs> uh, we've got to begin nipple water again. Oh, I'm gonna be eaten by a fucking gator. We really should have run into jewels by now. I reckon we should split up so we can search both sides. Okay, Arthur, since you appear so at home here, you take the right. We'll go left. What? Just keep your eyes open. Open for what? My immediate doom? Oh, I'm gonna be attacked by Gator, alright. I can see it.
You must be Jules. Where is the boat? I got the scarab. It's over here. It's stuck. Get back to the dock. Yes, please, let's go. Oh, take Morgan down. Thank God. So, uh, who are these fellas, Thomas? Two new friends of mine. I'll explain later. Jules, we are very happy to have finally made your acquaintance. I thought I was gonna be out here all night. What you doing hiding up in the tree, boy? This gator was huge, Thomas. Twice as big as I ever seen. Twice as angry, too. None. Oh, oh shit. Boy. I think we hit a tree stump. Yeah, I thought we clear. You're gonna need to jump in and pull us free. Me? Yeah, just do it. Won't take you a minute, boy. Go on. This is a bad Oh, he gonna idea. die. You'll we'll see any giant monster <laughs> long before it gets anywhere near you. Got a couple of cracked gunslingers here with the guns loaded. You'll be fine. You didn't see the thing. Yeah, neither did you. It's just a myth, Jules. Now pull. Come on, put your back into it. Jules? Oh shit, he did. He's coming for us. Oh, shit. Too good there. Here, take this. Try to stop the bleeding. 
gonna be okay, son. You're gonna be okay. Just thank your old Uncle Dutch. I heard that. There's still a lot of blood. You need to put pressure on it. I've stopped the bleeding. I think you'll be okay if he don't get a fever. We can bring down a fever. A fever is the least of our worries. Look who's back. God damn it. Put every bullet you got in him! Dead ahead! Fuck! You see him? Shoot! Okay, kid. Oh. Sorry, Jules. Guess all them stories was true. Big and bad. That's unusual. Normally, the little one's angry. Big one's is lazy. Well, I guess he never outgrew his anger. Kind of reminds me of you, Arthur. You know, I don't think I've ever seen you squeal before, Dutch. <laughs> I weren't the one squeal. Yeah, well, you weren't in the water with him. And this poor boy was nearly dinner. Can we get some help? Uh, Jules has been bitten. Uh, oh my god. There's a monster out here. Uh, he's been bitten, but he's alive. Uh, Just keep him warm. Uh, Feed him garlic for the infection. Thank you. Both of you. I'm at your service anytime you need. Thank you, Thomas. Where can we find you? You just meet me back here. Very good. Can one of you help me put the boat back out? Sure. I'm gonna head back to camp and placate the irritable Miss O'Shea, who's causing more trouble. I'll collect the boys. Meet you back here, Arthur. <clears throat> Mr. Arthur? <clears throat> Old Bronte. A bad man. I know. Killed some good folks. Hurt a lot of people. Well, he definitely lacks a certain charm. I'll see you soon. You be safe. You got monsters out here. <sighs> well. Well, and we just go right into the little uh, transition here. Ugh. We're getting some crafting. Cure. How about that? Let's throw that away. All right. Time for an afternoon nap. Dutch, right? But let me guess, there's a legendary gator out here, isn't it? Oh, bait shop. Look at that. Yeah. 
Nothing else really popped up around here. Maybe I can go hunt that legendary gator down. Yeah. Hey there. Did I kill something just by jumping in here? I guess I killed something right there. Huh? Alright, calm down. Kind of gator is it? The regular old gator. <laughs> I don't even show them there's a little wisp. Alright, let's go around. Yep. We'll go around, I know. You, you hate that thing, I know. It's okay, but a girl. 165 dollars. Anthony. Whoopsie! Okay, and we're back. Sound Yeah. Yeah, screw you, Gators. Fuck that shit, I'm out. Fuck that shit, I'm out. Oh, no longer pristine. Yeah, asshole. Yeah. I got on the path. Would you like that? Yeah, yeah, yeah shut up. If I'm here with Dutch, we're gonna buy ourselves some bait. I'm gonna go hit this Welcome mansion. to my shop. Please come look around. Uh, Have you used scent blocker before? Can really change a fella's luck out there. What is so interesting? Live crickets. Okay then. Thanks for your assistance. 
All right, Dutch. So, Dutch, what's Tahiti like, anyhow? Arthur, there you are. Come on. Thomas, let's get going. Right you are. <laughs> hey, Bill, you were a sharpshooter in the cavalry, weren't you? What? When we get there, maybe you could help with the suppression fire. I never said I was no sharpshooter. Oh, that's right. W what was it? The nation's most loyal latrine digger, wasn't that it? <laughs> yeah, well, I fought, and I fought well. So you always tell us. You taught me something you could do with learning. <laughs> Them Indians were savages. Watch your mouth there, boy. Watch it. Only type of savage in these parts are moonshine, swilling, pompous, inbred locals. Dutch, I saw things out there. I don't doubt you saw things, Bill, but your tiny little mind was too small to comprehend what you saw. What you saw was people who lost everything to savagery, savagery of peasants. Failures come from Europe to reap some awful vengeance on God's last creation. Interesting way you boys got to prepare for a killing. I'm sorry I wasted my life trying to teach you boys. Love you, though, I do. <clears throat> well, love, leaving love aside, <coughs> you think we got this? Don't you never leave love aside, Arthur. It's all we got. Pick us up yonder. I got you. Thank you. Good luck to you. Come on, quick. Stay quiet. Oh, there's a gun up there. Lenny, Bill, you're with me. Arthur, John, you take the left side. If you see a shot, you take it. Okay? Good luck, gentlemen. Arthur, let's go. <clears throat> let's go. Find some cover. Two up ahead. Have you got a shot? Something. Believe me about these statues. <laughs> you don't like making Arthur putting wine on you? It's like someone's looking at you when they're not. I'd get <laughs> A little close. Oh, no, I was too far. I mean, it just happened actually. Hit too close. Uh, let's go. Two up 
up ahead. Have you got a shot? We got more inside! Name your price. Name your price. Every man have a price. Eh? Okay, okay. No, I surrender. I surrender. I... Should we kill him? Nah. Let's take him to Dutch. You can carry him. I ain't touching that piece of shit. Hundred fifty-five on him. So where's that Mauser at? Oh, he threw it. Let's go, Arthur. Hold on. Where 
is that? Hold on, wait, wait, wait. Are we taking him to Dutch then? Angela Bronte photograph. Like I said, you carry him. Yeah, yeah, shut up for a second. There it is. Double action revolver for Mauser pistol. Hell yeah. Wait a minute. Where the fuck is mine? Where the fuck is my... If I lost my fucking goddamn weapon, I'm gonna be pissed. One second, I'm gonna loot this guy real quick. From where I'm sitting, you're the one deserving of pity, my friend. <laughs> all your men, all your money, it weren't no match for a bunch of bumpkins. You are nothing. You do nothing. You mean nothing. You stand for nothing. Me, I run a city. <laughs> and when the law catch up to you, you will die like nothing. I am this country. You, you, you are what people are running from. I possess things that you will never understand. You don't even possess your own men. A thousand dollars to the man who kills him and sets me free. What are you gonna say now? They are even bigger fools than you. No doubt. The law will find you. Already, the dogs are on the way. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, you're right. You are so right. right. They are good at smelling filth, huh? So oh. filth! has got to be disposed oh, of! Oh, Our friends of oh, are gonna come and rescue you! You oh, repulsive oh, little maggot! Oh, 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 oh. Call them now! You call them! Dutch! Philosophy books cover feeding a fellow, the goddamn alligator, Dutch. The part that covers weakness. Hmm. That part. Well, fuck. I don't know. Well, I do. 
It ain't nice. I know it. But it is us or him. I figure it might as well be him. Yeah, fuck him. Now, if I'm missing one of my revolvers, I'm gonna be downright pissed. Pissed. Alright, horse. Better have my other revolver, I so I'm gonna. Long time, girl. Bro. Okay, good. Woo! That's all I cared about. So, that still didn't change too much. Just calm down. Right. Good morning, Arthur. Hill. I'm telling you, that's this is the way to do this job. The distraction will buy you all the time you need. Sadie. It's the right plan. We've done the work. I've been in town looking. I can't I'm greet Sadie. I'm waiting. I've, I've tested it as well as I can. It's the right plan. I know. I just. I'm trying to say hi to you, Sadie. They don't want me to say hi. Nervous? I suppose, I suppose that's it. You're never nervous. That's been my job all these years. I know. <laughs> You're sure? Good morning, Arthur. Certain. Uh, well, not certain it will be done, Mr. Jim. Look, the bank. Karen, Tilly, Abigail. I sent them all. They all say the same thing. There's no more than one armed guard. And the police? It's a city, there are police, but as far as we can tell, the patrols will all be going this way when Abigail and I cause the diversion. That's the opportunity. What do you think, Arthur? I don't see we have a lot of choice. We linger around here, we know we're dead. But the plan? We got a decent bunch. We know how to fight. The city cops don't seem so tough as long as we move fast. I reckon doing it in the day with a distraction. If that's what Jose is saying, it's as good a plan as any. I think I agree. We do it at night. There's the dram of just getting into the bank. Can't do that silently. They'll pick us off far easier. I know. I'm, I'm just making sure. Every plan is a good plan if we execute it properly. Every problem we had was because we did not execute properly. Even Blackwater, from my understanding. You're right. Let's rob this bastard. Everyone get some rest. We ride out in the morning. Look smart. Travel light. You got it, motherfuckers. You got everything, Arthur? Sure. So, we rob ourselves a bank, and within six weeks we're living life anew in a tropical idol, spending the last of our days as banana farmers. Let's get out of this godforsaken place and go rob ourselves a bank! <laughs> let's go, let's go! Crack that whip, Mr. Matthews! Oh there. This is it, gentlemen. The last one. Where have we heard that before? 
What has happened to you, John? You lost all your heart. I'm just trying to stay real about all this. Real? Oh, how I detest that word. So devoid of imagination. How soon are we shipping out? Soon as we get a passage organized. Boat down to Argentina, then another around the Cape. What about the money in Blackwater? We're just gonna leave that behind? Forget that. It's gone. You all talk like it's the only goddamn money in the world. We're gonna take that and more. Take it from the people who take it from us. This isn't some big town hundred dollar operation. This is a big city bank. Right. With security, guards, police. Hosea has done his reconnaissance. We've been over this. The plan. One last time. Hosea and Abigail draw out the police. We go in calm and fast. John and Lenny secure the front doors. Javier takes the side exit. Bill, Micah, and Charles control the crowd. Me and Arthur deal with the bank manager and vault. Got it? Got it. Yep. Gentlemen, let us go ahead. Is How Jose going to sell need? us out? Not long. Fifteen minutes or less. You'll know by the noise. Any problems? The we'll see you in camp. Good luck, gentlemen. Right on! Yeah! Everybody know the drill. We head in hard. Stay calm. They won't be expecting us. Any minor trouble, head back to camp. We'll leave in a few days. You good, Bill? Sure. Then right on with Charles. We don't want to be seen heading in like some posse of country outlaws. This is it, cowboys! One more time! One more time. Let's ride! Yeah! Oh, shit. Let's go! Hitch up here. Gentlemen, robbing thieves, it ain't no crime at all. Folk like this, they stole what this country could have been. Stay cool, fellas. Act natural. Wait for Hosea to do his thing. This, this had better work. Looks like... Have a modicum of faith, John, will you please? Soon as we get out, load everything onto the wagon here.
Okay. Now then, Arthur, would you please have Senior Bank Manager here open up the vault? Get over there and open the vault. Now! Open the vault! Come on! This out. We need the combination for these safes. Those safes open. Tell them the combination. Got it. Okay, now, what's the second number? 72. All right, should be one more number. Last number. Come on! 54. You get that, mister! Okay, I'm in. 54. What did I tell you? Would you look at that? Get out of here! We got trouble! Looks like the ball! Come on! Shit. Let's go! Okay. Think we got a problem out here? Abigail. Dutch! Get out here! Get out here now! Someone must have squealed. You never should have gone after Bronte, Dutch. Mr. Milton? <clears throat> Let my friend go! Or folks, they are gonna get shot unnecessarily! Your friend? <laughs> Why would I do that? Come on, Milton! It's over. No more bargains. No more deals. Mr. Milton, this is America! You can always cut a deal. I've given you enough chances. Oh, shit. Come on. Are they gonna shoot him? God damn it! No. God damn it! There's your deal, Dutch. Who's there?
Where's everybody? What's going on down there? We lost control of the bank. The others are trying to hold them off. Okay. <laughs> he killed him. Nice. Arrested. I couldn't help. Well, we better go. We'll be next. <sighs> what you think? I reckon me and Lenny try and find a way across the roof, sir. If you'll cover us. Sure. Sure. Go on. Damn it! Oh, God, no! There's nothing we can oh, do! We gotta keep fuck. Jesus! Ah! Like your fairy job in Blackwall. Ain't nothing like that. <clears throat> well, what now? I don't know. I don't. <sighs> this whole town is filled with cops. Well, how long are we gonna stay here? Uh, a few hours? We go back to camp? They're gonna get every last one of us. I know they're going to be watching the roads. I got it. A boat. What you mean? We stay here till nightfall. Then we sneak on down to the docks. We get ourselves out of here. Yeah, where? Any place will do. That's all I got. We leave. We lie low. We come back for the rest in a few weeks. Nope. I'm guessing it's that. Will we die out there right now? Exactly. Now, everybody, calm down. I mean, oh, look at us. Uh, son of a bitch. Okay, follow me, and keep your heads down. The boats, come on! I hear voices. They hear tunes. Everyone stay. The rats will have to come out of their holes eventually. We should have had them in black water. That won't happen again. Men on every street. We can't stay here. 
Oh, I'm an idiot. Okay. Mm -hmm. Going the right way now. Sorry, Are you fella. going, Arthur? Go on, Morgan. Check the trains. You did? No more than a quarter hour ago. Are you sure? Sure. All right, then. Come on. Fellas, Arthur, head over to the water. See if you can draw them out. Draw them out? How? I don't know. Make a noise. Whistle or something. for us maybe maybe not well they ain't just waiting there for no reason yeah let me think for a second i'll deal with them what how i can't kill all of them silently so when they chase me you go the other way what are you talking about you heard what i said oh i like it real brave what in the hell who is Excuse me! Buddy! Hey, stop! Stop, stop! That is one of the most beautiful acts me, I ever saw. Come on. Yeah, that fucking numbers dwindle so much. Yes. 
John, Lenny, uh, fuck, what's his name? The old dude. What Man. now? Well, at least we got some gold, I'm sure. This boat ain't going to Tahiti by any chance. I don't know. John, Lenny, Jose, Jose uh, that wasn't good. I don't know. So what are we gonna do now? <coughs> Guess I'm gonna introduce myself to the captain. Give him some of this gold to secure his silence. And find out where we're heading. How do I look? Like a shifty, no good killer on the run from the law. Ain't that the truth? <coughs> Excuse me, sir! Hey, who are you? Forgive me! A stowaway! Can I see the captain, please? I come in peace. Well, it's gonna take a little more gold, but I think we're gonna be okay. This captain, he is a, a fine fella. A New Englander from the Cape. The rest of the ship is Frenchmen. They're heading down to the islands, taking some Pennsylvania coal. Now, apparently, we're gonna be able to slip ashore in northern Cuba in a couple of days. That's so. Apparently. What about the rest of camp, though? What are we gonna do in Cuba, Dutch? Hold up for a while, then hurry back, gather up the rest of our family. At least we got some money now. Money and loyalty. With that, you can do whatever you please. So you reckon they'll follow us to Cuba? Like Colonel Waxman on a jolly? I highly doubt it. I reckon we hold ourselves to ourselves, and this is done and dusted. Let's hope so. I ain't no sailor, but, uh... <clears throat> that cloud look like good news to you. Hmm. <laughs>
this Cuba? Another part of the Americas? I didn't lose my revolvers, did I? It is a miracle! It is a goddamn miracle! Here, have, have something to drink! Have a drink! Somebody yeah. give him a goddamn drink! Oh, son! Son, take it easy. Oh, we got you! We got you! So... We are on the island of Guam. Javier asked a local. It's a old sugar plantation island. Second island east of Cuba. Is it anywhere near Australia or Tahiti? It's on the way, I guess. So, what next? I don't know. <laughs> Well, next I guess we're gonna get shot. Encadenen a estos hombres! Gentlemen, this is quite a welcome. Who are you? Senor, por favor, we are no one. What's your name? Aiden O'Malley. Is that so? What are you doing, Mr. O'Malley? Surviving. We were lost at sea, in the storm. Is that so? No. I'm in the habit of looking like this. Is all of this really necessary? We got enough troubles around here right now, Mr. O'Malley, without taking a chance on a bunch of vagabonds. 
Behave yourselves and no harm will befall you. Vamos! 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 Muevanse! That means move! You got a long walk ahead of you. I don't get your drift, Mr. Uh... Levi Simon, senior overseer for Alberto Fusar. We run the third most productive sugar plantation in the Northern Caribbean. Of course, where there's money to be made, there's trouble. What sort of trouble? Oh, the usual sort. People wanting what ain't theirs and others telling them to take it. I don't get you. Labor troubles. And other thieves and pirates looking to disrupt our ways of working. How very upsetting for you. Not half as upsetting as it'll be for them. Mr. Fusar has a lot of very powerful friends. I will bet that he does. Bunch of Haitian pirates won't frighten him. They'll be strung up in the streets soon enough. And do we seem like Haitian pirates to you, Mr. Simon? You seem like someone or other. We was headed to Tahiti. You was going to Scenicraft. Just as soon as I know exactly who you are, you'll be free. In the meantime, you'll not starve. Cabo, llévese a estos hombres a la cárcel, junto con el grupo de cucarachas de ese campesino. Cualquier tontería que hagan, disparales a todos. Welcome to Guama, gentlemen. Now, if you'll excuse me. Yeah! Oh, that's a very nice idea. What say. now, Aiden? I don't know. What do you think? I think we've got to get out of here. Yeah, but they can't find out who we are. Well, for now, we're stuck, Ben. Well, for what it's worth, I think I would have preferred Tahiti. You and me both. Mm -hmm. Man, that's a long Who are these people? Who knows? Well, they got them chained and lashed, but they don't look too dangerous. Excuse me, sir. Who are our new friends here? <laughs> Criminales. What crime did they commit? Insurrection. <laughs> Insurrection? That's quite a word. Cállate, señor Fuentes. Muévanse. Todos. Right, that's his ass. There yet. Reinforcements. Mon Dieu. 
We need to get out of here. Now we're in trouble. Come on, come on, Fabit, everyone, follow me. Fabit, Fabit, come, come, come. Ah. 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 Javier! Oh, get out of here. Get out of here. There's a lot of them. Ah. What do you think? We gotta move, Dutch. Cool. Don't lose face, son. We'll find you. Cooey, cooey. Go, go. <laughs> Shoot, Come on, Arthur. Quickly, I have some gun stashed here. Come. That's hey. ladies' gun. Oh shit. What are you doing here? I have no idea. Running from somebody or something, I guess. How went we on? Hercule Fontaine. Dutch Vanderlyn. These drowned rats are Micah, Bill, and Arthur. Okay. Well, Fusa will be desperate to find you. We must be very careful. So. Who is this Fusar? A tyrant. Driven by nothing but power and greed. Our only purpose is to work ourselves to death to make him rich. Leon wants the people to stand up to Fusa, but most are too afraid. And you? I am not from here. I bring things in and off the islands behind Colonel Fusa's back. Let's, uh... Let's rest a moment. Down there is Equa Dolce, Fusa's compound. The sugar cane these poor men kill themselves farming gets processed in that factory there. They're little more than slaves shipped in from other islands. A group escaped yesterday into the jungle, hoping to find a way back to their homes. Now Fusa's men are out, hunting them down. That old fort? Cinco Torres. My men and I use that as a hideout when we are here. Come on. I know somewhere you men can rest. Can we trust you? I don't see you have any choice. I am the only one who can arrange a boat for you. But mm -hmm. I need something in return. Of course. Help Leon with that group of escape workers, and then come meet me at the fort. If you help us get back our friend and get out of here, we will do everything we can. Thank you. Gracias. If your friend is still alive, they will have him at Fusa's compound. There is a cave hidden below the cliffs. It will lead you right there. Thank you. The workers are somewhere in the jungle. Hopefully we can get to them before Fusa does. Of course. Gentlemen. Well? Goodbye. If this is a tropical paradise, so far it ain't up to much. I'll go scope the entrance to that cave. Arthur. I need to get some rest. 
Well, you're right. We all need to relax. What a mess. I am so sorry, boys. Get some sleep, Dutch. Micah, guard this spot. Bill, do some more scouting carefully. Am I? Did it still say a temporary horse somewhere else? It looked like it said on the map there. Good morning. Still can't believe it. Hosea, Lenny. Hosea was dying anyway. Lenny. Mm, well, you know what they say about pride before a fall. That's all you gotta say. I right, shoot you right here now. Uh off you go then, Morgan. Dutch is waiting for you, and, uh, <laughs> you have that worker situation to deal with. What are you gonna do? I was told to guard this spot. Just follow us. That's one way to get down quickly. Not again. My horse is not on the island, of course. Alright, well, we're gonna save it right here, guys. Or. Alright, when was the last auto save? 32, 4 minutes. Ah, oh, we're good. Alright, we're calling it here.